Hello and welcome to this video on dealing with procrastination. If you're someone who struggles with putting off tasks, delaying decisions, or wasting time, then you're not alone. In fact, procrastination is a common challenge that affects many people, and it can be particularly frustrating because it often leads to negative consequences such as missed deadlines, increased stress, and lower quality work. But there's good news. Procrastination is a habit that can be changed. In this video, we'll explore the psychology of procrastination, practical strategies for overcoming it, and how to make long-term changes to your habits. Part 1, The Psychology of Procrastination To start, let's take a closer look at why we procrastinate. There are several underlying psychological reasons for procrastination, including fear, anxiety, and a lack of self-belief. When faced with a task that we perceive as difficult, overwhelming, or uncertain, our natural response is often to avoid it. This can be due to a fear of failure, rejection, or even success, as well as anxiety about the outcome of the task. Additionally, if we lack confidence in our ability to complete the task, we may procrastinate to avoid feeling incompetent or inadequate. Part 2. Practical Strategies for Overcoming Procrastination now that we understand some of the psychological factors behind procrastination, let's move on to some practical strategies for overcoming it. Break the task into smaller steps. One effective strategy is to break the task into smaller, more manageable steps. This can help to reduce feelings of overwhelm and make the task seem more. For failure, try to focus on the positive outcomes and benefits of completing the task. Use affirmations and visualization techniques to imagine yourself successfully completing the task and feeling proud and accomplished. Part 3. Long-Term Changes to Your Habits Finally, let's talk about how to make long-term changes to your habits to prevent procrastination from becoming a recurring issue. Develop a routine. Establishing a consistent routine can help to reduce decision fatigue and increase motivation. This can include setting a regular sleep schedule, planning out your day in advance, and setting aside specific times for work and leisure activities. Practice self-care. Taking care of your physical and mental health can also help to reduce procrastination. This can include getting regular exercise, eating a healthy diet, practicing relaxation techniques such as meditation or yoga, and seeking support from friends or a mental health professional if needed. Seek out accountability and support. Finally, seeking out accountability and support can be a powerful way to prevent procrastination. This can include working with a mentor or accountability partner, joining a support group or online community, or simply sharing your goals and progress with friends and family. Conclusion In conclusion, procrastination is a common challenge that can have negative consequences on our lives, but it's also a habit that can be changed. By understanding the underlying psychological factors, using practical strategies for overcoming it, and making long-term changes to our habits, we can break the cycle of procrastination and achieve our goals and dreams. Remember that overcoming procrastination takes time, effort, and persistence. It won't happen overnight, but with practice and dedication, you can develop new habits that will serve you well in all areas of your life. So, whether you're struggling with procrastination in your work, personal life, or relationships, know that you have the power to change. Use the strategies we've discussed today, be kind to yourself, and keep moving forward one step at a time. Thank you for watching this video on dealing with procrastination. If you found it helpful, please like and share with others who may benefit from these tips. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more content like this.